here. My name is Bing and I'm a foster carer for Baby Blue Bunnies and I've been volunteering for one and a half years now. And today I'm going to talk to you a bit about what fostering is like for a rescue. So I'm currently fostering a lovely, lovely pair. Uh, we've got little Bitsy here. She's one years old and she's a mini lot and she's very, very fast paced. She loves doing binkies, zoomies, running around because she's very young and very active. And this is in comparison to Brayton over here. He is about six years old. Uh, he loves chilling out on this little blanket, any blanket. Um, he likes the slow paced life compared to Bitsy. But you can see that they're both very, very snuggly. They, <laughs> they love chilling out together. Um, they love like grooming each other and just spending time together. So in total, I've fostered eight bunnies now, including Bitsy and Brayton. And Sometimes I get singles and sometimes I get pairs and it's the pairs that generally take a bit longer to adopt out compared to the singles. Um, I've had very different ones from young ones like Bitsy one years old, I've had one that was nine months old up to a pair that were ten years old. So it just really depends and there's different breeds as well that I've fostered during my time and they all require different diets and it's just so interesting to learn about them all and by fostering I get to meet a variety of bunnies and just getting to learn all about their their quirks, their personality and their behaviours. Sometimes I get friendly buns that likes pets like Bitsy. Sometimes they don't want to be touched, but that's okay. It's on their terms. One of the best parts about fostering is just being able to be a part of every rabbit's journey. As being surrendered to the rescue is not always easy for them and they might not always have had the best start in life. So my participation in being able to care for them and making sure they're, they're well looked after Obviously, I know my time is limited whenever they come in through my doors and I never know when they will be adopted out. So I just treat every day like it's the last and just making sure they're getting all the right treatment and just enjoying that their, their temporary time with me here and just making sure that they have the best home until they find their forever home. Isn't that right, Bitsy? Hmm? Yes. Here you go. If you have the space and time, whether indoor or outdoor, it's definitely something you can look into and it really, really helps the rescue. And I've met so many different kinds of rabbits, personality, and we also have a really great foster network. Um, everyone is always there to help each other with any questions and you will always have the full support of the rescue during your whole foster time. Other thing with fostering as well, like there is less commitment compared to if you were adopting an own, which your own one which could be up to 10 plus years but with fosters they kind of come and go you can take breaks when you holiday breaks when you need to it's more flexible in that way but for myself i know that i'll be fostering for a long time to come